some um, patch green chili from New Mexico. And I, I grew up in Southern California and um, I interviewed with the Hyatt here in Huntington Beach and they didn't have a space for me, but they were like, he was like, I wanna, you know, uh, move your resume around to some other properties. And they gave me a call to New Mexico and I went out there and I was like, this is kind of cool, I like it. And so I just, I gave it a shot and I fell in love with the Southwest, yeah. I liked it, I, I just, the culture, the food, um, it was just a cool place. I went to Santa Fe to the farmer's market and it was Romero's Farms, I still remember the name. He's still there at the farmer's market and he was roasting and it smelled, the smell was intoxicating. And so I went up and he was just serving a little wedge of a fresh tortilla with hatch green chili and the sea salt on top of it. And it was like magic when I tasted it. So I just fell in love with that simplicity. And it was just an amazing flavor. Yeah, I'm from Santa Fe, so we're very excited about the chili. And uh, fall is the best time of year in New Mexico. And you always look forward to that smell of the hatch roasting. So we were super excited. He saw that they were um, roasting chili this weekend. So we came down, it's like an event. So tonight we've been looking up recipes to make green chili sauce. And we're gonna, we're gonna try our hand at making tortillas. <laughs> Learning about the chilies, there are so many different varietals. Um, I don't know the number off the top of my head, but there's a lot and they all range in size the thickness of the wall of the chili. Some are better for stuffing, some are better for roasting, some are better when they turn red. So there's a lot of different varietals. Um, we tend to find Big Jim, um, and uh, this, we like the Sandias, because they've got some good heat. Um, and we also like when they turn a little red, which is called like an autumn roast, when they're half green, half red. So um, yeah, there's a lot of different varietals, um, different flavors and heat levels. And it's just, it's a great condiment to cook with. Lightly opened a little bit, okay. so they get cool. Just okay. before you freeze them or anything like that. Got it. Freeze them. Okay. Eight pounds right there for you, girl. Thank you so much. I got it. Thank you. You're very welcome. Thank you.